bread, blood. We have crates that we can, uh... Wait, can I just jump out of here? Shut up. Okay, we're desperate. <clears throat> I don't want to be in a situation where I'm going to frenzy as soon as I go outside. Alright, we got some whiskey and chocolate. Hey, no one! Thank you very much! Here's some, uh, here's for some whiskey. Pour two fingers and then go drink the bottle. <laughs> it's that kind of week. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Man. That's so, <laughs> like, three different switches, a little underground path. Surely. Maybe we don't come from here, or maybe maybe this is uh, this is closed. Maybe you walked through here before, and now one of the things happens with this. Can I even make them jump to the other side? I assume not, but nothing down below us. No. Okay. Wall run. Parkour. Recently heard something about the game's release, by the way. Supposedly it was the first Source Engine game to ever go gold. It was held back because Valve wanted Half-Life 2 to be first out of gate, so it technically should have been released even earlier. Wow, that would have made it even rougher. Um, and it's still annoying that like they released it basically the same week, so we still never went through that door, which is fine. They released it on the same week as Half-Life 2, I think, uh, and it got it only sold like something like 80,000 copies. Like, it was a commercial disaster. Um, right, okay, so I don't, I still don't like how low in blood I am. So we're going to go into another combat zone here. Don't eat the homeless. So we uh, we got the hint to go to you know, effectively because of the flyer to go somewhere where um, where those symbols are. And I'm thinking about maybe snacking on one of the prostitutes and hoping that uh, that doesn't backfire on us and make us sick. There you go. There's the uh, the sun thingy. Actually. Walking alone down a dark alley. Um, I don't know if this would count as being public or private. Because there's this fella over here. Been to the disused hospital yet. Pretty cool side quest. No, I don't think so. Whiskey and chocolate. Oh, it's nachos again. Hold on. Hey, babe. Hey, baby. Looking for a date? Uh, how much? For you, honey? 50 American dollars. Like Best we... money you'll ever spend. I have plenty of money. I promise. But, um, I think if we got our seduction up a little bit higher, I think we can, uh, you know, eat for free. But we got a contribution to the Blood and Donuts Fund from Cool Man Nachos. <clears throat> who said, I must feed on rat for blood. Also, blood for the blood god. Thank you very much. Blood for the blood god. Um, all right. Uh, it might be fun to have a little bit more seduction. Uh, next level subterfuge would cost nine, and it's only used for seduction. We get, uh, let's get our second pip in appearance, which should bring us up to a seduction of five. It may, might open up some more options. Plus, you know, we want to be a sexy, sexy vampire. Hey, baby. Looking for a date? Mmm. For a hot one like yourself? My well, we still don't get a freebie, but we get a built-in discount right out of the gate. Uh, I'm gonna go for it. Well, for you only. Don't go telling any of her friends about this. A girl's gotta make a living and all. Mmm. Let's go somewhere more... intimate. You lead the way. All right, I think uh, probably over here. To 
doesn't have upper eyelids, it's all lower eyelids. I don't think that guy's gonna pay us any attention. Hey. Hey. Come here. Alright, well, I guess we quick save. There's some. I want my money back! That that sound, that's my the failed feeding sound. I want my money back! She glitched! And I can't feed on her! Hey, baby. Mmm. For a Well. Mmm. Hey. Okay, what's happening here? When she, when you hear the hay, she's she's no longer following us. Hey, baby. Are we going too far? Mm. Well, for you. Mm. Hey there, need a day? Maybe I'll just go next to the truck. Not here. It's too public. Not here. Don't move. Is it because she sees this guy? Maybe it's because she sees this guy. I'm gonna I'm gonna reload on the base and, and not go through this. Um just on the basis that, that feels pretty glitchy, so oh well. Is that guy smoking from his armpits? Sorry, I, I it's whiskey and chocolate. Okay, where was the, uh, I guess uh, we can just walk back through the alley. Nachos! Skulls for the skull throne! Did you know mango wine is a thing? I did not know mango wine was a thing. Yeah, beat it, punk. You're ruining my, uh, my midnight snack. Oh well, let's just go ahead. I'm sure we'll be fine. So what did the note say? I am enlightened. Oh. What's up, brother? You enlightened? Yes. Given the fire. I, I thought I would have to remember the code. The, the bishop will see you upstairs. The bishop. Alrighty. Does it say gained access to the crack house? Gained access to the crack house. That's exactly what it says. Excellent. Hey. Did, did you get summoned? You're going Feed? upstairs to see the bishop. Um... Yeah, yeah, I heard he can only move on diagonals. Um, I guess either way we have to be... Uh, durr, uh, durr, durr, durr. You're new to the Brotherhood, huh? Just got enlightened. I, I've been here a few... Hey, it's the bishop I'm thinking that has the shotgun. When the bishop wants to see you, <clears throat> you'll be summoned. Which is going to be tricky as a melee build. And then you go up these, um, these stairs up to the, the t temple. Okay, all right, come on. I get it. Um, new team, what's he like? The, the bishop? Yeah, I, I saw him once. He is beautiful and scary. I, uh, I dream about him all the time. He does, uh, things to me in my dreams. He does, uh, things I, I don't like to remember. Yeah, you should go home. 
I don't know. I mean, I, I hear things, but but I haven't been summoned. I had a friend snuck up there a few days ago. Said she saw things, bad, bad things. Yeah. What? What did she see? Blood. She said, um, b -b blood everywhere. Oh no, blood. She saw a few of the summoned to try to uh oh to talk to them but they just just stared at her with these um these woo blank looks you know no, one of them uh, started reaching for her and she she ran away listen up maybe the brotherhood isn't all it's cracked up to be like maybe you don't actually want to be here or you sound scared I know. The b b bishop said we have to shed our. Um, I don't want to skip. I just want to. Uh, on our you know. journey to the, to <laughs> I want her to start stop stammering so much. But I'm, I'm scared to go upstairs. I, I just, uh, I just, I just. It's actually spacebar to skip. Actually, I think you can hit anything to skip. Uh, I guess there's not an option to tell her to just like go. I can leave her alone, but I can also. I could nom. Oh, pretty cool name! Thank you very much. Thank you for all you do. Buy some deliciousness on me. Stay safe and be well. Well, thank you very much. Mmm. Mmm. I could buy a lot of that. Uh, a lot bunch of people are saying three. Come here, have something that will ease your pain. All right, Twitch chat. We're not gonna kill her though. Although I could. This is a combat zone. But, you know, I kind of feel bad for her. Up and upstairs. Wow, I have shit dark vision for a vampire. Alright. I think these guys are basically just zombies. Yeah. Yeah. Ninja! Ninja vampire. Oh shit, there's a ton of them. Are you a zombie? Or are you just... I couldn't tell if that was a zombie type person or just... Someone a little drained. Okay. Luckily these guys are really slow. No fast, no fast zombie tropes around here. Okay. Anything else in this room? Nope. I don't know if there's any pickups like lying around or anything like that. Uh, this thing. I'm gonna put it way over here so I don't get screwed by the physics later. I think it just lets you avoid some combat if you're not a combat oriented person. But I am a combat-oriented person, so I'm just going to come back through the front door. I don't like the idea of, like, crouching through there and then going right into a fight. <laughs> Excuse me! Ah, mmm. Hey, rats. Oops, I just activated celerity accidentally. Did that person just explode into chunks the first time I hit them? Just wanted to cancel that before celerity renewed. Touching. Some of these take like three strong hits to down, and some just like instantly explode. Maybe you get crits. Okay, since there is a tough fight coming up, and you know, I love rats. Rats are great. They're brilliant little creatures. I would like to not kill rats, but we are going to need... 
just a wee bit of blood. <clears throat> if you're an Osferatu, I think you get more blood from each rat. And if you're a Ventru, I do not believe you can eat rats at all. In fact, you can't eat most people. Other way I could have crawled through this. Anything back here? Okay. These doors are all closed. We got some more rats over there, but. Oh, there you are. Oh, I didn't check the corners! Come on. Stand up so I can punch you. Thank you. I think trying to feed on the zombie dudes is, is bad. Dead. Okay. Am I going down? Bishop was supposed to be upstairs, but there's just just a quick exit out. Well, let's find out. Yeah, I think I've just backtracked here. Or not. Never mind. If there's things to kill, we're probably going the right way. Oh, insta-gibbed. Less zombies in here, you remember? We have a really good, like, build to, to take care of these zombies. Say, so, oh. Hang on. Let me... Yeah, so we could have come around here a different way. I'm, I'm gonna want to go through those... The fancy doors in a sec, I think, but... Don't want any zombies to still be left alive behind me. <laughs> yeah, this I think this is the shotgun guy. Are you searching for something? Do you seek the truth? This guy looks crazy enough to storm the U.S. Capitol. Right place, brother. We got more truth here than we can handle. <clears throat> uh, are you the leader of the Brotherhood in Nine Circle? They call me Bishop Vic, Shepherd of the Damned, your midnight guide through our last days here on Earth. Do you feel it, brother? The curtain being drawn back at last, drawn back by my hand, by the Brotherhood of the Ninth Circle. Uh, last days here on Earth, you talking about Gehenna? Gehenna, Judgment <clears throat> Day, the Apocalypse again, brother, you are too indoctrinated into the antiquated beliefs of this... He's either that or he's like, Macho Man Randy Savage. Yeah, brother, are you talking about the end of days? Who? <sighs> over their children. You talk of disease. What about the disease that you and I both carry? Our flesh remade into nothing more than an abomination, feeding on our brothers and sisters like so many cattle. What God watched over me when that demon tore into my neck and made me into this monster you see before you? No, brother. There is no God who would tolerate such a thing. And so I have become God, and the diseases I carry to the masses will bring about an end of my own making. <coughs> Until we have all... You got a little bit of COVID there, buddy. ...into the ninth circle. Uh, you lost your mind, Vic! This is insanity! 
I understand your feelings about being a vampire. There's no way to deal with it. I think this is a little out of my league. I'm going to hit the road. Uh... Dude, you be crazy. The time for words has come and gone, my brother. You and I will take those... This guy is coughing a bit. <laughs> what truth lies behind the curtain. Let the night fall forever on this cursed earth, and let the fruits of my labor bring a long and bloody harvest. Wait, I know we can work this out! Bring it on, Vic. Yes. Fucking celerity shotgun. Stop to reload. Oof. Okay. Damn. We're not, uh, not completely done yet. Ah, no. That is not the attack animation I was looking for. Did, um... Did I give that, the, the female one? So, oh, that one's just cowering. I think I must have given her. So after that, she clipped through the floor. Still hearing some zombie sounds. I don't think it's coming from them. So I got my XP. Is that just done then? Killed Bishop Vic, head of the plague uh, bearer doomsday cult, thus ending the disease. Report back to Damsel. And and the regent. I think we ultimately will report back to both of them. Saved by rat blood. I mean, yeah. I wonder if they'd be diseased. I mean, the disease stuff is over, so I think now it's safe to start feeding on people. They might literally be here so you can have a mid-fight snack. Nope, diseased blood. Well, since I'm already sick... Oh, you think they're supposed to be zombies, but the game is bugged? Oh, shit. So, okay, it's vomiting up all the blood and doing damage to me? Oh, I hadn't realized that. That's really bad. We have to, there's really not a quick exit. Hold on. Um, why can't I move? Oh, maybe there is a quick exit. Maybe as soon as you leave the room, it, like, teleports you outside. Since Legacy, had you download RimWorld? Yeah, I'm enjoying that game. Alright, well, we are desperately low on blood. Oh, wait, let's, uh... Oh, we're right here at the, 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 the Shantry. Let's go and turn in part of the quest here. Hello, Neonate. How can I be of assistance? You have a few minutes to talk? Of course. I solved the problem with the epidemic. You have? Impressive. It's the Morpheus. What exactly? I do have a blood bag, but, you know, trying to save it. Because it's an RPG. I'm going to end the game with, like, 20 healing potions in my inventory, because that's the way it goes. It was a blood cut called Headed by a Vampire Named Bishop Vic, a Plague Bearer. Tell me of this so-called bishop. He wanted to bring about the end of the world. See, that end may very well be upon us. But to business. 
I have a debt to pay you for your services. Yeah, you do. If you so desire, I can give to you a unique talisman that might be of use in the future. If that does not interest you, I can compensate you with hard currency. What do you think, guys? Do we want a little bit of money? Or do we want a unique item? Hmm. It's so hard to decide. <laughs> or do you want what's in the box? I'll give me the cash, baby. I'll take the item you're talking about. Oh, 